the structure robots in three, two, one, go! Match number 53 gets underway here. We will see the Blue Alliance machine of 21 or 2990, rather hot wire. They are currently ranked number six. They have a blue banner in their belt from earlier in the season. They won Wilsonville down in Oregon. We'll fire off that cargo at the top hub for blue, but the Alliance is only able to pick up three pieces of cargo there in that autonomous period. Likewise, Red Alliance not making the quintet an autonomous either. We've seen Jack and the Bot do it themselves before, but this match just wasn't what happened. They do still have the lead, however, on the points, 24 to 20. And both of these alliances have offensive members fully capable of putting up 20 pieces of cargo pretty much on their own if they had to. Uh, but we'll see how that shakes out here over the next two minutes. Spartronics for the Blue Alliance currently putting it in park with a solid safety light on the right side of the tarmac. Still plenty of time for them to get reconnected. Their alliance partners will come up right behind them there. Hotwire in 2990. They'll actually zoom out of the tarmac, launch a piece of cargo, launches over top of the center hub. Second one connects. Three red pieces of cargo connecting six points in total across the alliance. Those are coming courtesy of Jack and the Bot, and it appears the Iron Patriots. We've seen the Iron Patriots do a lot of low goal scoring other times this season, but they're starting to pick up some high goal scoring as well. Double the points there in the driver control period. The high goal is worth two, the low goal is worth one. Those are doubled in the autonomous period. Red Alliance currently leads 63 to 28. About a minute left to play here. Still down the Blue Alliance robot, so it is still a 3-2 power play favoring Red. Actually, you know what? Scrap that, it's not a 3-2 power play. It's just a 2-2 as Iron Patriots also lose connection. They'll reboot and continue their cycles. Get more red cargo stuck at the end of the hub return shoot. And finally gets knocked free. Just enough cargo finally making its way into that center hub to knock stuff loose. 32 seconds left to play, and the Red Alliance leads by just shy of 50. Red Alliance machine making their way back towards the Red Alliance hangar. That's the Chargers out of Kent lining up on that middle rung. They latch on. That's a nice, clean, easy six points for them. Jack and the Bot will join them on the middle rung and very quickly evacuate the area, making some room underneath them for their Alliance partners, the Iron Patriots, to get a low rung climb. That's worth four points. Jack and the Bot gets up there. Looks like they're good for 15, as long as that traversal counts. Blue Alliance side of the field. Hot wire was aiming. Lions. Your final score for that one. 114 points red, 50 points blue. 4-0 split on the rank points there. That will, those four rank points will hold Jack and Bot in second rank position and move Iron Patriots up from 12th to 7th. Yet more contention there on the leaderboards.